Hey, welcome to a video from digitaldeepak.com and in this video I would like to show you how to install the Google custom search engine on your blog. So I have installed the Google custom search engine on my blog and if you scroll down on my blog you can see here there is a search box called Google custom search. So here if I search for something like let's say drip marketing and click on search I get an overlay window with some Google ads and some results and these results are just from my website so here you can see the first result is drip marketing which I searched for and if I click on it I will be taken to that particular page so in this tutorial I will show you how to uh, install a Google custom search engine for your blog as well so what you can do is go to just Google and search for Google custom search engine here you will get a result uh, which is csc.google.com just click on that and here if you want to add a new website just uh, click on add here so I will just delete my existing site and show you how to add a new site so I click on add and once I click on add I have to enter the URL of my website here I can also add multiple URLs here so that the Google custom search engine will uh, bring up results from different websites however that is optional I can include a name for the search engine which I will leave it as deepak.biz then click on create and once you click on create now the custom search engine has been created there is an option to get code and install it on your website but there is also an option to view it on the web if you click public URL then it means that you know uh, this particular URL you can link from anywhere and uh, this is a search engine to just search within your site just enter my name and click and here you will be getting results from within that particular website so this is the public URL which you can link to or what you can do you can click get code and once you click get code uh, you can include the code on the sidebar of your theme and once you include it in the sidebar of your theme the width of the custom search engine is dynamic so if you see it on my website here you can see the width is dynamically set which means that if the sidebar is a little bit wider or narrower this will get accommodated automatically so now that we are done and all you need to do is just uh, uh, co copy paste this code uh, wherever you want the search engine to be displayed let us go back and see what are options that we have so what I am doing here is just opening this particular search engine and here I have some options so right now this search engine is a free uh, search engine there is also a paid version of this uh, where Google asks me to upgrade and uh, if I upgrade uh, there will be additional options such as uh, the sponsored uh, results will not be shown here I also have the option to make money where uh, I can monetize the results uh, probably using my Google AdSense code so here it says that you make money when users click on an ad uh, that they see the search results by connecting your uh, account to Google AdSense and then there is uh, an admin section where I can add more users uh, there are some advanced features as well I can change the look and feel if I go to look and feel uh, you saw that uh, here if I search there is an overlay coming on my site right so if I click here it is an overlay uh, this is the default option but uh, there are other options other than overlay such as two page full width two column compact results only and Google hosted so you can go ahead and experiment with this uh, there are also some themes which you can choose uh, different color options the default will be the default one which resembles standard Google search results and then there are other options as well uh, you can install uh, the search engine and then go ahead and uh, tinker with it uh, you have the option of uh, displaying thumbnails in the search results you can see that in my search results there is a thumbnail displayed this thumbnails are automatically taken by Google usually the first image on the blog post is taken as a thumbnail image and then you have search features statistics 
and other options as well but i hope uh, now you know how to install the google custom search engine on your blog if you have any questions uh, just leave a comment below and if you are watching this on youtube please subscribe to my youtube channel for more digital marketing tips and you can always visit my blog digitaldeepak.com and thanks a lot for watching this video see you later bye bye